All right. Welcome back to Zelda Episode 8, baby. We are flying through this playthrough right now. We, uh, last I conquered this shrine and we made our way to Guerdo Town. Now, the catch to this place is apparently you have to be a girl to join or to enter. Kind of sexist, but no cap. It's a joke. But I don't know if we need to... Hold on. This music... Oh, uh, what? Mmm. God damn. Is that Kyra? Yeah. Last time she can ghost me twice. Cups that are rose. Screw you, Kyra. Go away. All right. So, we're going to try to enter this place, see what happens. And, of course. Oh, my God. Freeze. Huh? Where do you think you're going? Not in town. Not into town. That's for sure. No vote allowed. Off with you. I'm sorry. I can't get over this music. How do I get in? Oh, I bet you it's right here. They can't see me. Uh? What? Sound the alarm. A vote has been detected. Capture him at well, capture him at once. Okay, I guess I can't sneak in. Let's see if anyone has some. Oh. Hmm. Vote are forbidden from entering this town. This is Guerrero law. Do you understand? Never. Come back. Okay, Dora. The Explorer. Bars. What's up with this guy? Benja. Oh, I was so focused just now. Do you have business with me? Are you spying? What? No. no I am not a spy. I'm just looking at... The beautiful girls that come out of this place, that's all. Hmm. Why is this guy really... Why is he just staring at me awkwardly? Am I... I'm a merchant. I may not look like it, but I'm actually the leader of a caravan. I've traveled all the way here, but this town doesn't allow men to go in, so... That's why I had to, um... Are you spying? It's research! Research. And I think what you want, but I've... Finally found some key info on how to sneak into Guerrero Town. Oh. Okay, give it to me. Give me the moose. Spill the tea. <laughs> well, allow me to share with you my heroic tale. It's been close to a week now. The guards have kicked oh. me out. Oh my god, I don't care. Oh. I hear the man who infiltrated Guerrero is frequently traveling between Kara Kara Bazaar and here. So I'm waiting for him. I plan on asking him how he pulls off his amazing infiltration. My plan is flawless. I'm going to him. So we have to go back to... The bazaar. Can, oh, can I use a sand seal? Oh my god, if I can use a sand seal. Yeah, yeah! What's your name? Frelly! Sand seals are important in transportation the road, but the sand seals wild the train. They make them especially trained. Many people find it easier to just get into just one one. And that's where a skilled sand seal trainer like me comes in. Come talk to me if you have any questions about sand seal. Uh. How do I catch one? Sand seals are spe especially sensitive to sounds around them. The trick is to approach very, very slowly. It's a pain in the neck, though. So most Guerrero just end up renting one instead. I know how to crouch game. You know the best way for you to learn is how to do it is by just doing it. Okay, yeah. You're ha if you're having if you are having a hard time catching one, come by my shop in Guerrero Town. I rent. I can't get in. I'm a vo. You know this. Yeah, exactly.
I'm gonna get this sand seal. <laughs> yes! Oh, yes! He's mine now. Let's go. Bro, this is filthy. I'm like wakeboarding. Look at this ish. Come on, sand seal. Underlay, underlay, underlay. We gotta go back to the bazaar so then I can get some clothes or something. I don't know. I just gotta talk to this dude on how to get in. Goodbye, sand seal. Thank you for the ride. Car, cars, bazaar. I bet you he's up here. I bet you he's up here. What a thrill. I freaking knew. Hee hee hee. Okay then. Oh my, what a lovely young lad you are. Do you need something from me? Hmm? Cut the shit, I know you're a guy. What's that? You heard about a man who snuck into oh. Guerdo Town? Oh, I don't know anything about him. Sorry, I couldn't be more help. I'm squinting suspiciously. Hee <laughs> hee. You're making my cheeks want you. Looking at me like that. Oh. You are very beautiful. Oh, such a nice thing to say. And I'm sure you agree that these clothes only help my looks, right? Now that I think about it, this style would look quite fetching on you. I'd have to charge you, of course, but I bet people would see you completely differently if you wore them. I knew you were a man. Cut the shit, old man. Give me your clothes. I'm robbing you. This is a stick-up. Uh, no thanks. Are you shitting me? This is some bullshit, man. I don't need a lot of money. I guess I'll sell these. Yeah, that'll be enough. Cool. Thank you. Damn, she's slumped. I gotta run. Dude, look at my Sansi all slumped, too. Everyone is slumped. Except for that. Holy crap. Except for that AT, AT that's about to go pew pew all over the Puerto town. Alright, cut the shit, man. Give me the clothes. Hee hee hee. You still haven't given up on the, your search for the man. Oh, you still haven't given your search for the man who's staying in the Guerrero Town. I told you I didn't know anything. Mm. He he he, you're making my cheeks mm. You're a man. Oh my. You sure say the funniest things, young man. Anyway, you don't need anything. You should be off then. Mm. <laughs> yeah, 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 we know. Mm. I'll take them. Oh. I'm now broke because I have to buy girl clothes. They really are right. Woman clothes are expensive. Perfect out for me, huh? Perfect outfit. Ooh, stun on them, Link! Okay! I see you! Go off! <laughs> Look adorable! Ah, oh, he, he Oh my god, he- Oh my god. Just as I thought, you make for a quite good- Good looking gal. That's a traditional Guerdo outfit. It's such a striking look around here. I doubt anyone would even suspect that you're a man. On top of that, it breathes so well that it's sure to help you deal with the desert heat oh. at least a little. I'm so glad I was mm -hmm. able to help you out. If you're free to grab something to eat sometime, keep me in mind. I told you, cut the shit, old man. Why are you surprised, Link? We knew this. Come on, man. Heh, <laughs> make sure you watch out for the wind. Yeah, face palm. If you want to get more ladies' clothing, come back anytime. Link? We need to dye your outfit as soon as possible. Oh, I can fast travel there, but I think now we can get in. Hell yeah. Last episode I said I was rich. I'm flat broke now.
I want to see if this dude will recognize me. Eek! Eek! That lovely young lady is just my type. Eh? What? No, of course not. I'm just investigating. Hmm. This exchange feels incredible. Dude, you don't re. You're hopeless, bro. What is that guy doing? That guy wasn't here before. I'm gonna go in though. Nothing to see here. I'm just a girl. Book it, book it, book it, book it, book it, book it. Forbidden city entry. Damn. Sandstone. Okay. What do we got here? Some hardy durains. Hmm. Okay. Saba, What's Saba. up, girl? Saba Saba. Great. You got the last of my free time with that greeting. What's the matter? I manage a shop that specializes in handmade accessories, but I've run out of flint. I need to make many items. If I had ten, just ten, some vodka could give me some ten pieces mm. of flint. I could a nice word. I could dream. I want though accessories. Bitch, I know I want some diamond earrings. Give them to me. Oh. Gems have their own power in this game. How did I not know this? How much flint do I have? Do I have ten? Oh, she's so sad, man. How much flint do I have? I have seven. Girl, I'm sorry. I'll bring you some flint. Don't be sad. You're really cute. Don't be sad. Looks like we got some... Ooh, should I buy the mushrooms? Oh, they don't have zap shrooms. Okay, what do Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're definitely dying in these clothes white. Damn. Got meat. Bunch of arrows. Oh, look at the little kiddos. <sighs> okay, we made it in. Ooh, what's over here? Just rock salt and shit. Okay. I have plenty of that. Except for the wheat. What's over here? The fuck is going on in there? Hello? Oh. Is she practicing talking to a guy? She is. Oh my god. Hey, what are you doing coming in here? It's really rude to just barge in what I'm practicing for getting a job in a restaurant, obviously. Yeah, I bet. Oh, I bet. Oh. What's the password? E. Oh. Q. Oh. A. Mm -hmm. Exclamation point. Go drink milk in the bar or something. The secret. Okay. Chest. Oh, yeah. Ow. F screw you, chest. Ooh. A golden bow. <gasps> I can pray here. I'm doing heart. Yes. I shall grant the power you seek. Hell yes, baby. Let's go. Give me an extra heart. We're one step closer to getting the Master Sword. Let's go. Let's go. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. Yes, goddess. Alright. Dude, this place is pretty. And the music is nice. Is this the palace? Ooh, there's the queen. She's a little young. Ryu. No. Riju? Rihu? Yet another traveler. Oh, she's got a voice. How did you get in here? 
Seems you have something rather interesting there. Is it my Sheikah Slate, my Nintendo Switch? Show her what's up, Link. Show her what you made of. Huh? You stand before the Lady Rihu, Chief of the Guerdo. Declare your business, but come no closer. She's badass. Royal Guard? Hold on. Hold on, Bula. I don't know how her voice went. This one appears to be more than a common traveler. You there. What is your name? Blah, 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 blah. Link. And what is it you've come all the way here to tell me, Link? I can call Naboris. Uh. You think you have what it takes to take to subdue something so powerful as the divine beast? Hell fucking yeah, I do. The only ones who could ever control them were champions like Lady Urbosa. Urbosa, Urbosa. Jesus, spit it out, Cooper. And all of the champions died in calamity a hundred years ago. Except for me, bitch. I'm back from the dead. Hmm, Boleria, a memory just jumped into my head, something my mother spoke of. When the calamity happened, the princess of Hyrule placed a fallen swordsman into a deep sleep. The swordsman, much like our new friend here, was named Link, though it always seems more legend than fact. But Lady Rihu, do those same stories not also say that the Hylian champion carried a legendary sword? I know I don't got the master sword, okay, chill, but I'm that person. What's up? I'm here. I'm ready to fight. If I recall correctly, the, it was called the sword that seals the darkness. The princess of Hyrule supposedly hid it away in the forest somewhere. Mm. What of the device on this one's hip? It appears to be a precious relic of the Sheikah. I can't imagine they would give something so valuable to a simple drifter, can you? Mm. I don't remember ever hearing of a Hylian vow vi among the champions. Oh. Wait a moment. You're a vow! A vow within our walls is a great crime, but a vow who is a champion. Oh. Well, you never mistreat a friend of Lady Arbo Arbosa. And if you are here to help with us with Naboris, then we are allies. Huh? You saw it on your way to our town. Divine Beast Vod Naboris cloaked in a massive sandstorm, hurling lightning at any who dare approach. Mm. We have to do something to stop it. But we have yet to find any way to appease the Divine Beast on our own. If you truly are a champion, perhaps you will be able to enter Naboris and calm its anger. Mm. Lady Ryu, I don't see how you can trust a complete stranger with something as important as this task. Perhaps if this person were the first to prove his worth by recovering your stolen Thunder Realm. Mm. Ah yes, an interesting suggestion. You see, there is only one thing in all Hyrule that can withstand the lightning from the Boris. The Thunder Helm, a family heirloom, and the relic of the Guerdo. But as you don't need to worry, L Lady Rihu, if he truly is a champion, this should be an easy task for him. Oh. Our soldiers can tell you all you need to know about the thieves who stole Lady Rihu's heirloom. Head through the arch. It will lead you to the barracks. Then seek out Captain Tiki and ask for a full report. Without my heirloom, you'll never be able to approach Naboris. Heh, <laughs> <laughs> you know. I take heart in having such a rare visitor as yourself, Lady Urbosa. Urbosa might be looking out for us. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Alright, I think I'm going to leave that episode off here. Um, we got in. And... We made it to our destination, so I'm just going to delete that pin. But, um, we'll see what the war heroes have to do. And next episode, we'll definitely dye our damn clothes. Because these colors ain't popping, Link. I'm not going to lie. But the clothes itself, the design is popping. But I'm going to leave the episode off here, y'all. If you enjoyed, don't forget that like, you know. I'll see y'all in the next episode, y'all. I say y'all a lot. Peace, peace, y'all.